Courage Everyday Adventures of Samantha Brown Let me see where to begin. Somewhere in the middle of a country lived a girl. Well, to be slightly more specific, the girl lived at a university in the middle of the country. She lived in one of the most remote dorms on the university's campus. But no one at her school called it a dorm, they all called it a flat. And that's what she called it. Her name was Samantha and there wasn't anything particularly interesting about her. It was just another weeknight, or maybe it was the weekend. Samantha wasn't entirely sure, nor did she really care. Samantha sm- spends most of her time alone in her room. The only time she's not in her room is when she's in class, at the library, or hiding in a corner somewhere drinking coffee. Samantha's been sitting in her bed for the last six hours waiting for everyone to fall asleep. She's hoping to catch the kitchen in a rare state of abandonment. And this is where we join her. Oh, before I forget, watch out for the hunger meter. It's there, to, it's there to let you know how hungry Sam is getting, but be careful too many wrong deci- decisions and something terrible could happen. Okay, get it. Uh, one more thing. To move forward in the story, simply click on the dialog box. If you need to return to the main menu, click the upper left corner. Your progress will be auto- automatically saved so you can continue your quest at any time. Well, that's it for me. Good luck. Oh. Hey, uh, what'd you do today, my sweets? Some cut. Oh, this is cute. She's watching a movie and chatting at the same time. Charbot. Hey, not much. Just hang out with the cat. What about you? Me, the usual. It's some homework. Watch. Oh shit! No, skip. So, do you think anyone will be in the kitchen right now? Oh. I don't know. What time is it there? Like that thir- ten thirty ish. Also, why do you care if anyone is in the kitchen? Uh, tell the truth. So I wanna go make oatmeal, but I don't want to see me making the oatmeal. You really think people care? It's possible. Have you had dinner yet? Well, not really. Sam. Well, I was going to get food, but then the grocery store was closed and I was watching my show and I was all... I could go make oatmeal or just eat a flapjack from the men- vending machine. What is she watching? I'm kinda curious though. But I'm still not entirely sure what a flapjack is, so... I don't know what a flapjack is too. Sam, don't be silly. Go make yourself some food. Fine. I swear if I see anyone. Okay, here I go. Five minutes later. I can do this. I just have to get out of bed, get the oatmeal, and walk to the kitchen. That's easy. People walk to kitchens every day. Oh. See the oatmeal is just right over there. Okay, I'm officially out of bed. Which kind of oatmeal do I feel like today? Uh, anything is good. Apples and cinnamon? Yes, this is the one I want. I just have to figure out how many packets to make. Should I make one, two, or three packets? Oh gosh, the decision making. Uh, Let's stick to safe, something safe. Two seems appropriate. Two says I'm hungry, but I'm not a cow. Two is a totally reasonable amount of oatmeal for someone to eat. Ha, woo! I made a choice. Look at me making choices like an adult. How'd you get this far if you're not making choices? Wait a sec though, I still need something to eat this with. Coffee? And what do we have here? It's a kitty mug. Now it's time to play. Choose that food. Oh 
TV. Is this a what? A live TV show? The only game show where you choose that spoon. Oh, it's a live TV show. Please choose that spoon. Ah. Oh, you win. Tell them what they won. What? What's happening? You won an amazing all purpose ETU utensil worth an estimated value of $199.95. What's going on? Or, oh, okay, it's. What's happening inside her head, okay? Alright, now I just have to grab my mug and off we go. Alright. Mug, check. Oatmeal, check. Spoon, yep. I think that's it. Hmm, wait, just hang on a minute. What if someone's in the hallway? I mean, should I go out there right this second? I kind of feel Samantha's overthinking. Yeah, like, I, I don't want to be around other people. I kind of get that. Come on, go ahead. You need to eat. Eat, eat, eat. Whoa! I have to walk all the way down there. Oh, you get a little woozy, huh? I'm not gonna make it. You can do it. Move it, lady. Uh, wait in your room. Take it slow. Yeah, just take a deep breath and everything will be fine. <sighs> yep, everything is totally good. There, that's a little better. Don't force yourself to walk, so I gave you some time to slow down. I just have to take this one step at a time. Yes. The thing is, I'm just not a people person. Yeah, I, I, I understand that. I'm not a people person as well. It's hard for me to talk to people and I stutter a lot and I don't know what to say. So, I totally relate to Samantha somehow. Even just, I've, I've seen some a few parts of her in the game. Anyway. I tried to tell everyone, but did they listen? No. I mean, communal kitchens? That's the worst possible idea. Here you go. Eat in front of a bunch of complete strangers. How about no? How about I eat in the safety and comfort of my own room? Yeah, bitch. I, I will go for... I will be down for that too. Party in my own room. Woohoo! I don't know what I'm saying. No one will bother me then. Yeah, that's a much better idea. Here I am creeping like a creeper. Creeper? Bah! Uh oh. <sighs> Shit. Is someone coming? Okay, false alarm. Onward. I just want to eat my oatmeal in peace. Don't want to see anyone. Why does this, this sound like a horror game though? I don't want to hear anyone. And I sure as hell don't want to talk to anyone. Cause you know what? The last time I talked to someone, they told me I did my eyeliner wrong. So what? Do, do your eyeliner the way you want it. Small eyes, that's what she told me. Made my eyes look small and I should trust her because she knew how to do makeup. So who, who cares if she knows how to do makeup? At least you're, you're doing your thing. But what the hell am I doing? I wear makeup every day. Is she saying I don't know how to do my own makeup? Cause that's super rude. It w she has her own style. That's why maybe but don't let her criticism be belittle your 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 style. Like, how about you refrain from talking about my face until we've known one another for like five minutes? Calm down, dude. It's just a eyeliner thing. It's not a big deal. This is that the light. Oh my god! What if people are in there or worse? What if they want to eat with me? Oh gee, I, I would be terrified of that too. Sh sh should I go in? Uh, probably. You need to eat food. Oh, there are people. Oh gee, nightmare confirmed. Should I say hello? You people still say hello to one another. What should I do? Say yeah, hi. Hi. What's with the awkward stare? Why aren't they saying hello? Do they think it's weird that I'm eating so late? Like, oh, she's probably already had dinner. Now she's back for more. I could tell them I haven't even had dinner yet. No, that's stupid. Why would I say that? Fine. 
Just get your damn food and eat your in your room. Don't mind them. There, I made it. That's like half the bottle. Okay, so I can't use any pots and pans because I don't technically own any. But there is this electric kettle. I'm, I'm assuming anyone can use that. I mean, I remember in the student orientation guide, it said all communal kitchens came with a kettle. So they must be talking about this kettle, I think. I've never actually used one of these before, but it can be that hard to figure out. Still, you think there would be instructions somewhere. What's that quote about? Do I take that thing out? somewhere give it a quick stir and now I wait <laughs> man what's so funny oh I I'm Making her, making her, uh, feelings worse about this. So sorry. Thanks, Sam. What the heck can I do to waste some time while this cooks? Cause I can't just stand here looking at the oatmeal like an idiot. Don't hide. Uh, maybe clean stuff up. Oh no. Yes, cleaning. That's a totally normal person thing. I think it's a legitimate reason for someone to be in a kitchen for an extended period of time. What are you sponging for? You're cleaning the sink? You don't have to clean the sink. Please, oh please, be something resembling really cooked food. What? How is that not even close to being done? Great, great, now what? Uh, oh shit. Try the microwave. What? It's gonna overflow. What do I do? What do I do? Didn't stir it. Just leave it. Uh, stir it. Okay, I guess I'll just stir this every few seconds. Yep, gotta cook it. This is taking forever. I can hear her heartbeat. This microwave is so freaking loud. Put it back in the microwave. Keep cooking it. 
Get, gotta be getting close now. Please hurry. Uh, okay, I'll try that one. Okay, that that made it worse. Steer, steer. Such a cute cat in a mug. Cut face mug. Mug smug. That's it. It's done. It's got to be. Fudge cake. Oh no, that's hot. How the hell am I supposed to get it out of a microwave? Maybe you use... Oh, don't you have any other option? Maybe an oven glove or something? Just grab it and go. You, you'll get burned. So. Or maybe wait a few minutes to cool down. Jeez. Um, I guess I'll take out the cup first. Use my shirt like a glove. This is actually ingenious. Yep, I think yes. I think this is actually working. I'm leaving so I can... You can have your precious kitchen back. Ooh, I made it out of there. Gotta go, just have to get back to my room. Almost there. Unlock my door. I guess I should put my cup down. Yes, you should. Here we go. Wait. Where are my keys? What? I can't believe I forgot my keys. I guess I'll just have to wait here until someone comes by. Shit. There wasn't any option to, ch to, to check for the keys. What now? Eat your damn oatmeal! Check spoon. Yep. Okay, that's it. Um, wait. Just hang on a moment. What if someone's in the hallway? I mean, should I go out there right this second? No. Uh, are you sure you have everything? What about the things? Ah. Okay. Can't believe I almost forgot my keys. That would have sucked so bad. Damn. And I went all the way charging to the hallway. Without thinking about the keys, I didn't think you need it. You don't. I don't think you need to lock your room. Would have stopped. That would have sucked so bad. Okay. Okay. Should I go now? Yes. Whoa! I have to walk all the way down there. Never gonna make it. Should I wait? Wait in your room longer. Forget it. I mean, maybe I don't even need to eat this oatmeal. What the One day without food isn't the worst. What the hunger? Fine. There, that's a little better. I just have to take this one step at a time. Thing is, I'm just not a people person. Try to tell everyone, but did they listen? No. I mean, communal kitchens? That's the worst possible idea. Here you go, eat in front of a bunch of complete strangers. How about no? How about I eat in the safety and comfort of my own room? No one would bother me then. Yep, that's a much better idea. But here I am, creeping like a creeper. Bah! Is someone coming? Okay, false alarm. One word. I just want to eat my oatmeal in peace. 
I don't want to see anyone. I don't want to hear anyone. And I sure as hell don't want to talk to anyone. Because you know what? The last time I talked to someone, they told me I did my eyeliner wrong. Small eyes, that's what she told me. My, my eyes so small, I should turn to her because she knew how to do makeup. What, what the hell am I doing? Because those, 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 uh, uh, I already did read this part, so can we skip? Is that the light? Okay. Oh my god, my paper and they're over. What if they want to eat with me? Should I go in? Gotta eat, dude. They didn't say hi, so I don't have to smile uh, to say hi again. What should I do? Say anything? Yeah, screw them. It's like, yeah, I'm going to make oatmeal. What about it? Everyone thinks oatmeal is gross, but it's really good and it strips cholesterol from the arteries, and that seems important. Just do your thing. There, I made it. That's like half the battle. Okay, so I can't use any pots and pans before I don't... Because I don't really own any, but... La 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 la. Okay. Okay. What the heck can I do? Waste more time on this. Stand here looking at the like an idiot. I'll try this one. Okay, that's. I think that's worse. The corner's good because someone can see me here. Okay, that just makes it worse. So I guess I'm supposed to meet with my advisor next week. Oh god, it's increasing bad. I told us to come prepared with questions. The only problem is I don't have any questions. Okay, I was right the, the first time because she gets distracted, distracted while cleaning up. Please, oh please, be something resembling cooked food. Oh, how is this not even close to being done? Wait, wait, now what? Try to walk away. Wait, it's gonna overflow. What do I do? What do I do? Um. Okay, it doesn't move. Okay, I guess I'll just stir this every few seconds. Yep, gotta cook it. It's freaking loud. Keep cooking. Why are you cooking it every few seconds? You can just wait for one minute or something. I don't know. I don't know how to cook a microwave. It's gotta be getting close now. Uh, yes, better safe than sorry. So 
So I guess I'm her inner voice, huh? Sounds like it. You just have to keep her calm. Make her feel relaxed even in an uncomfortable situation. That's it, it has got to be. Okay. Maybe use your shirt. It's the safest bet than using your hands alone. I used to use my shirt if the cup's too hot to carry for. And maybe you can have your precious kitchen back. Gotta go, just have to get back to my room. Almost there. Knock my door. The keys. I guess I should put my cup down. Yes, you should. Take the key. Here we go. Okay, then. Almost. Woohoo! Yes. Hello, room. I missed you. Goodbye, world. I did it. I, Samantha H. Brown, have made oatmeal. And now. I eat and watch movies. Yay! Huh? And you know what? That wasn't even so bad. Congratulations. You helped Samantha make oatmeal. That was nice. I like the the very chill and aesthetic art and then the font. It 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 ma matches the theme of the the game. It's cute. And, and the soft pastel colors and the aesthetic of the of the games. I, I like it. It's really nice. So I was her in her voice. Huh? Thanks for playing. I kind of failed at the first one, but at least at the second attempt, she went well. Good for you, Samantha Brown. You made an oatmeal. Th that's something you should be proud of. Anyway, th uh, this is Captain Reverie, and I'll see you in the next video. Let's sail across the ocean of stars.